Hey there, tech enthusiasts! Welcome back to our channel where we dive deep into the exciting world of technology. Today, we've got a topic that's bound to blow your mind. The showdown between 5G and the future superstar, 6G. Buckle up, because we're about to take you on a journey through the evolution of mobile networks and what it means for all of us. So watch to the end as we dive into the potential negative aspects of 6G. First things first, let's talk 5G. You've probably heard the buzz about speed, speed, and more speed. We're talking download speeds that'll make your jaw drop, reaching up to 10 gigabits per second. That means saying goodbye to buffering and hello to seamless streaming. Imagine binge watching your favorite shows in glorious 4K without a single hiccup. But hold on to your seats, because it's not just about faster Instagram scrolling. 5G is unlocking a whole new world of possibilities. Augmented reality, virtual reality, and real-time multiplayer gaming are about to get a serious upgrade. Imagine teleporting yourself to a virtual world with friends from around the globe and feeling like you're actually there. And it's not just about entertainment. 5G is paving the way for smart cities and the Internet of Things. Picture this, this, traffic lights that sync up with your GPS to make your commute smoother, garbage cans that let the city know when they're full, and healthcare devices that keep doctors informed. About your health in real time. That's the power of 5G. But, wait, just when you thought things couldn't get any cooler, let's talk about 6G. Yep. You heard that right. We're already talking about the sixth generation of mobile networks, and it's like 5G on steroids. While 6G is still in its early stages, we're talking about mind-blowing potential. Picture downloading an entire high-definition movie in the blink of an eye. And I'm not talking about ordinary movies, we're talking 4K, 8K, and whatever crazy resolution they come up with next. But it's not just about speed. 6G aims to be the brain behind the Internet of Things. Imagine AI-driven communication that understands your needs before you even say a word. Your devices will work together seamlessly, making your life easier and more connected than ever before. And here's where it gets really exciting. Imagine life-changing medical application. Remote surgeries performed with precision, thanks to ultra-low latency. Doctors collaborating in real time across the globe to save lives. It's not science fiction, it's the potential of 6G. Of course, all these amazing things come with their challenges. Developing 6G means pushing the boundaries of technology. We're talking about super high frequency waves and intricate network architecture. But hey, where there's a will, there's a way. Awesome viewers. We couldn't be more thrilled to create incredible content for all of you. But hey, we need your support to keep this show going strong. So, if you enjoy what you see here, be sure to hit that like button and hit that magical subscribe button right now. Oh, and here's the best part. Leave us a little comment down below with the magic words I have subscribed, and we'll know that you've joined our fantastic community. All right, let's talk about the elephant in the room, the potential health risks associated with 6G. Now, before we get into it, I want to make it clear that 6G is still in its early stages of research and development. So, while the technology's exciting, we can't ignore the questions it's raising. You see, 6G is expected to operate at even higher frequencies than 5G -R. These super-high frequency radio waves have shorter wavelengths, which means they have more trouble penetrating obstacles like walls and even human skin. Now, here's where it gets interesting. Some scientists worry that these shorter waves might lead to more energy being absorbed by our bodies. And as we all know, when it comes to technology and health, caution is key. You might remember that with the rollout of 5GU, there were similar concerns. The World Health Organization has classified radio frequency electromagnetic fields, the kind emitted by mobile devices, as possibly carcinogenic to humans. That's a pretty serious label. Now, I want to emphasize that the scientific community is divided on this issue. 
While some studies suggest a potential link between radio waves and health problems, others claim that the energy levels emitted by these networks are far too low to cause harm. But the debate continues. As we approach the era of 6G, it's crucial that researchers, tech companies, and regulators work together to thoroughly investigate any potential risk. Transparency is key to building trust in these advancements. So, what does this all mean for you? Well, it means staying informed and asking the right questions. Keep an eye on the latest research and developments in the field of 6G. Stay curious, and don't be afraid to dig deeper into the information. As of my last update, 6G is expected to start seeing early research and development around the mid-2020s, with commercial deployment potentially by the late 2020s or early 2030s. So, whether you're streaming your favorite show on a 5G-powered train or experiencing the future of healthcare with 6G1 things for sure, the future of mobile networks is going to revolutionize how we live, work, and play. Thanks for joining us on this journey into the tech-savvy future. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more mind-blowing tech insights. I love hearing your comments, so hit me up. Until next time, stay curious.